Hello everyone, this is going to be a teardown of the one mini to replace the fan as uh, I've been having fan issues, if you've seen on the video. Um, I bought this from Droix, but I also had the GPD warranty. Droix cannot deliver to Japan, so I had to get GPD to send me a new one. Droix sent me a new one to my home address back in the States, so it's good to have a backup. But this is just going to be a quick teardown and me replacing the fan. There is, one, two, I believe, five screws on the back and then three screws next to where the ports are. This one's always a bitch to get out. This screwdriver isn't the best. But I started having these issues back in early October. Droik's took about two weeks to send me a new fan. GPD didn't have any in stock for the first, uh, or GPD didn't have any in stock till late October. And then they shipped it out and there was an issue with China Post coming to Japan. So I had to wait a little longer. There's three screws up here. So I've been, I was able to play it until it started to get really bad, and I haven't been able to play the Win Mini since October 21st, as of recording, it is the 11th, here in Japan. Overall, I am still enjoying my time, but this fan thing has put a whole damper on it. I hope if they make a 2025 model, they get a stronger fan in. Because other than that, I've had, like, no issue. I was able to fix the trigger issue with just by unscrew just by uh, loosening the screw on the back plate. It was too tight, and it was causing friction. Ah, oh, dang it. Be careful when you take this off. Because this is attached to something. Ow. So, there's the old fan, here's the new one. Uh, so we're just going to take this piece of electrical tape off. And there's three screws right here. I Be careful, I've heard some people who drop screws on the motherboard. I've heard it short has shorted the motherboard before so I would be very careful uh, in here the only thing that's connected is here so once you get it unscrewed you just need to very gently take that out I'm gonna use a q-tip because I don't want to risk breaking it I mean the fans already broken I just don't want to risk screwing up anything else so right here there we go old fan out new fan well let me check something real quick New fan in. Should just fit right there. Then you just need to screw it back in. So three screws. One, two, three. Little fat one. Fat screw goes bottom right hand. Dang it. Here, I'll do the other two. First. One screw. Ah, oh, shit, hold on. Should probably make sure that there's enough travel for the thread. 
Can't tell. I don't really tinker with technology all too much. The old one. Okay, so. Oop. Drop the new fan. Rip. I'll be back in one second. Okay, I'm back. I had to figure out what way the wire should be facing. So it said red facing towards the inside. If I can get that back in. Sorry, I got very fat fingers. So stuff like this, very difficult. be easier if the battery was not in the way but I'm not trying to mess with that Trying to find something else I could use that isn't metal. Oop. Okay, I think that's in. Before I put the back plate on, I'm gonna make sure the fan spins. Okay, and then this little piece of tape is just to uh, direct air. Probably should have got a new one, but nothing's gonna hurt. I'm gonna try and get this little piece of tape off too. It doesn't matter too much. All right, well, now that's done. See if the fan works. Might not have battery. I'll be back in about five to six minutes uh, when this fan or when this device charges up so I can um, test out the fan. See you then. Okay, I'm back. And what did you know it? Fan is working and no issues. Very nice. So, fan's working. Still is kind of loud because, you know, it's a tiny fan pushing a lot of power. But it's working. So, that was a success. Now that we got that back in, it's time to reassemble. So, back screws.
Remember, if you guys get a Win Mini and you have trigger issues, where it's like too stiff and it's like grinding against the housing, it's probably because this screw was screwed too tight. Uh, I fix it just by loosening it a little bit. But yeah, as I finish up putting this back together, um, plans for 2025 are still in effect. Uh, still want to move to more scripted content. Uh, me and the guys back home are also making a gaming channel where we will play stuff like Siege, GTA, and um, Ram uh, Borderlands when it comes out. Uh, I'm not sh too sure on the exact first video date post for that, but uh, go check out Fall Through Media Group. It's kind of like a skit channel. It's more so for just goofs, laughs, than anything serious. And then I am really interested in seeing what they what they do with um the Win Mini 2025. If they do a Win Mini 2025, I would be surprised if they didn't. I mean, they've done three models of Win Max 2s. They've done two GPD Win 4s. Actually, I think they've done three. I don't know. I would be surprised if we see a Win Mini 2025 refresh. I would more expect so uh, Win Mini 2, which who knows what the details are. Personally, I hope for an OLED screen with VRR, but I don't know if there's anything that matches that. That's out. All right, let's test. Okay, triggers are fixed. Everything's fine. All right. I'm going to put it under some intenseness to see exactly... Um, how the new fan ha handles. And this is the old fan. I don't have this rubber bumper thingy, but the uh, bearings broke on it, as you can hear. But yeah, this was the old fan. And GPD was extremely helpful with this. So was Droix. So I can say w with full certainty that I, if, you, if you're not adverse to fixing your own tech, if you don't care about the drawbacks, and more importantly, if you live in America or, I'm trying to think of anything else because this is kind of like a perfect device, maybe a little bit bigger of a battery, if they make the screen just a little bit bigger, I mean, yeah, that fan is certainly pushing air. And it's not making any noise, so this was a success. It's just... What the hell? There we go. Good to you. I have uh, videos coming out about Borderlands next year. But, um, as I was saying, it's not going to... Next year's content, it's not going to be like, uh, completely stop doing videos on, um, the Win Mini. Well, now that we've tested aggressively mid, that has been all. Bottom of my slogan out.